Welcome to Issues in Japan. This time two topics. One is Foreign Minister Hayashi to coordinate visit to China, approached by Chinese Foreign Minister Wang Yi. Another topic is India-Japan Foreign Minister confirms coordination for Prime Minister Kishida's visit to India. First, China. In a recent phone conversation with Chinese Foreign Minister Wang Yi, Foreign Minister Hayashi revealed that he was approached by Wang Yi to visit China, and it is expected that arrangements will be made in the future. Foreign Minister Hayashi was interviewed on BS Asahi's news program. He commented on the diplomatic stance toward China, saying, We are very concerned about the problems in Xinjiang Uyghur Autonomous Region, Hong Kong, and the Senkaku Islands. On the other hand, we need to take a multi layered approach, cooperating on common issues such as environmental problems. He also revealed that he was asked to visit China in a telephone conversation with Foreign Minister Wang Yi on the 18th of this month, and that he expects to make arrangements in the future. This is the first visit to China by a foreign minister since December of last year, when then Foreign Minister Motegi visited China. And the next is India. India Japan Foreign Minister confirms coordination for Prime Minister Kishida's visit to India. Japanese Foreign Minister Hayashi held a telephone conversation with Indian Foreign Minister Jay Shankar for the first time since assuming office and confirmed that they will coordinate to realize Prime Minister Kishida's visit to India, saying that it is extremely important for the two leaders to resume their annual visit. The phone conversation lasted about 20 minutes on the afternoon of the 22nd. The two foreign ministers agreed to work closely together in order to strengthen bilateral relations between the two countries, as next year will mark the 70th anniversary of the establishment of diplomatic relations between Japan and India. They agreed that it is extremely important for the leaders of the two countries to resume their annual visits to India and confirmed that they will make arrangements for Prime Minister Kishida's visit to India and for the holding of the so-called 2 plus 2 ministerial talks on foreign affairs and defense. We also agreed that the four countries of the Quad, including the US and Australia, will work closely together to realize a free and open Indo-Pacific, said Foreign Minister Hayashi. In addition, with China in mind, they shared a strong will to oppose unilateral attempts to change the status quo by force and economic coercion in the East and South China Seas as well as to deepen cooperation in economic security, such as strengthening supply chains. That's all for now. Thank you for watching.